People picked on me because I'm different. You felt out of place. You didn't feel like you were in the right place. You were only friends with people who had similar experiences to you and had the same issues as you. And some could say that some are negative influences on you. There are things I know, there are things I miss about the way people interact. If life was a journey, I'd probably be nearing the middle stages, but not quite there. I'm near the end of the starting stage. The challenging part of it being a teenager is that you're turning into a man. You're not a kid anymore. Yes, legally you're a child, but you're not a kid anymore. And you're growing up. You're going to be an adult. And that's a part of being a teenager. No, being a teenager is hard in general. Because you're changing either way. No matter if you're autistic or not, you're going to change. It's the same. I think I'm a bit pessimistic about some things and optimistic about some things. If I could change one thing about the world that's most important, that would be that you could accept more people. You could accept people You need to learn that you can still fit in into the world even if you have think differently and behave differently.
when I'm at home with my parents, it feels like I'm safe. It feels like there's nothing to worry about there. My mother is a very nice person and she helps me with all the basic things in life. She's probably a role model for me. She got bullied a lot when she was in high school and she put up with it. My dad is a special person because he's probably a role model on what to do when you're older. Because he's done a lot of special things in, with the church and in life. One of my former best friends I lost on the journey to moving schools. A victim of being out of touch or stress. I've been friends with him since 2017 where we met in the same class. And then we kept on going. And the only thing we would do at recess and lunch is talk to each other. Unless we weren't here. And then this year, a little after I moved schools, something bad happened and we're no longer friends. I, I feel, I still feel sad about it. Even if he's probably moved on, I don't think I have. My mind hasn't moved on from it. The happiest memory of this year so far is probably the wedding. My older brother and my sister-in-law got married. It made me feel happy for them. I might get married, I might not. It's hard for people like me to find love. 